announcements to the schedule. We'll catch you up with all of those and give you the conference standings in a moment. 2-1. That's a liner into right field. Base hit. Skidding over. Leak tries to cut it off. Sinkfield will move to third, and the Trojans have pieced together a couple of two-out base hits to mount a threat against Sprinkle and the Mountaineers. In the a ball and a strike. Base is clear. Troy leads 1-0 here in the second inning. And the pitch. That's a ground ball right back up the middle. It's got eyes, and it trickles through for a two-out base hit for the second consecutive inning for Troy. Give Riley Smith the best chance at throwing Frederick out in case he does hit the road. High drive right field. That will get to the wall. Playing it off a of one hop is Leak. He will throw to second base, and Sinkfield is there easily. Frederick holds at third, and the Trojans have set the table now. With get him in rather than a bunt. You want to play for a big inning while you have the chance, and this one may get it done. Down the left field line, it'll rattle around in the corner. Two runs will score easily. Goodwin lopes into second base with a two-run base hit. Three to nothing, Trojans. Just been an RBI. Closed out the first inning with a comebacker to Sprinkle. Runner at third. And the pitch is hit deep to left field. On the run is McGowan. He will look up. It's gone. <laughs> We've been waiting on that one. Smart, the only one in the starting lineup without a home run. And he did not miss that one. And he just rips that one through the wind and gives a big inning to the Trojans. First homer this year for Chase Smart. A lot of those. Manning early, 0 for 1. Comes to the plate for Troy with two men down in the third. And he'll hit this one deep to right field. Looking up is Lee. It's gone. <laughs> Touch them all, Manning early. His second, check it, his third of the year. And Troy is now up six to nothing. He hit the daylights out of that because he really had to put some power on it to get it in the air enough to get over that wall and still have enough. Up one in the first and then five in the third with a couple of home runs. That one's deep left field into that win. McGowan will go back to the wall. He will leap and that one's out of here. The Trojans were their third home run on a day when we thought that the ball would be hard to get out of here. A solo home run from Drew Frederick, his seventh of the year. The Trojans get one back. It is seven to two. Shows how much I know. I thought the ball would never carry. Saturday, it's an Easter egg hunt for the kids with the Easter Bunny after the game, after the one o'clock start on Saturday. That's in the air to left. Back goes McGowan. Back, back, back. He looks up. It's off of his glove. And it'll be another double for Goodwin. He goes as far as he can, leaps up in front of the wall, and it hits off of his glove. And the Trojans continue to just right now. And the wind continues to pick up as this game has progressed. 1-1 one, one pitch. Way outside into the backstop. Coming in to score is Rigsby Mosley, and the Trojans have played it a run. It's 8-2. It's a wild pitch and for a strong seven inning performance in his final non-conference tune-up against North Alabama. And he's been trying to get to that level since. He is very good tonight. Here's the 0-2 and that's on the outside corner. Good morning, good afternoon, and good night. That's it for Tyler Leak and for Appalachian State in the eighth. One, two, three, go the Mountaineers. Troy grabs the bat in the home half of inning. Number eight in Troy, the Trojans eight and the Mountaineers two.